Welcome back to Rebecca's Travels. Today I'm going to be doing a less and all right here in the UK. So let's get right into it. Now according to linterbank.com um, the following five places um, are actually less known or destination in which you can visit and the crowd in in a so let's go on with it now is Clevedon Pier um, a venue for events um, as the the words of the great poet on then, then, excuse my pronunciation, Clevedon Park is uh, the most beautiful in England. It is located in the town which is in Middlesex, in the county of England, in the country of England. Is total length three hundred meters. It's open on days and weekends from ten to five p.m. So, and so open from ten p.m. to p.m. weekend as well. So again, not many people know about this destination and. Again, if you want to be proud and have a unique experience in Cleveland, um, again, it's a, it's a place to um, go and visit. And um, on the pictures, it looks absolutely stunning. So I would, if um, I went of summer that I would love to go and explore and visit but, um, I would also want to take um, photos and um, make a video of it because it, it does st it's done in the website um, you could also get, get a picture of Moodle as well or the search and next we can scale excuse my pronunciation is a fish in Cornwall and it is famous for its churches and beautiful beaches like surrounding villages. It's a perfect destination for those people that like uh, walks. Um, myself um, or camping or fishing, car flying and even in the gorgeous sea as well so I guess it also looks a very beautiful on destination visit and in the UK again where you can also be the crowds um, of popular cities locations or as popular beach destinations for Blackpool etc as an alternative uh, number three is Catrick a railroad bridge The, the bridge is so high as well. This is a bridge it's situated near Ballantin Bay, excuse my pronunciation again, in North Island. It's created by fishermen way back in 1755. 
it is a centimetre long and at a height of 30 metres square at a high and um, it it's a most perfect destination to go on a walk wildlife spot or amazing sightseeing so again i would love to if i get to go to northern ireland anytime and um, get, get to see the catrick bridge and um, obviously if you don't like heights then this is not going to be an adventure for you um, because obviously you've got to be reasonably thinking and like and basically really per perfectly it and obviously like to do amazing sightseeing wildlife spotting or on walks and obviously don't mind it's easy so it is a perfect fascination but for that or if you maybe want to conquer your fear of Perfect for that as well. Um, so uh, I think it looks stunning um, on the photos. And um, number four is Knock Valor Logan Beach. It's the association game, one of the best beaches situated on the island of well, off the coast of the main Scotland. Perfect for scenic place for some reason obviously on hot or and exploring sandbars at, at galleries or just exploring the unknown and again great if you're looking to uh, base um, keep away from the crowd, crowded places such as in Edinburgh in Scotland and uh, basically look for tr uh, tranquility um, and calmness and beauty so and it looks amazing to go and visit I ever got a chance to go to the island of Mall in Scotland. It really does look amazing. Um, number five um, is Glasgow Neopolisis. The Neopolisis is a fa fascinating Victorian garden cemetery which is six. six next to Glasgow Cathedral. It is spread over 75 acres. Wow. And officially was in April 1833 in Victorian times. There were basically 3,500 monuments and of 18 Commonwealth Service personnel. So wow. Fascinating, absolutely fascinating, and again, place where not many people go in the city, and again keep out places in Glasgow and see the beauty and explore um, the history around there and absolutely fantastic so and it's back next to the cathedral so, which is amazing it's amazing as well 
um, off more destinations unknown um, and known at lintelbank.com on that website um, so I'll be telling you more and um, more of those destinations next week and for people that want to travel to the UK like beat the crowd for people that live in the UK who live not too far away from places or maybe people that want to go actual holiday in the UK also some of these places like are to go on uh, and visit and catch a red road bridge, knock Valley Beach, and Galos as well. Uh, again, off to go and visit. Um, you may have to pay for car parking, but the actual place is free, or you may have to give a donation um, to say if you wanted to, to say Cleveland, etc. So, um, for destinations. visit um, for free and uh, to less known unknown destinations thanks for watching please like and subscribe if you haven't already done so. and I'll have my next travel video which is and it's going to be more chat updates um, for you next week so please you all, you all mean the world to me, viewers and subscribers, you all the best of you, um, have happy 2020 and bye for now, thank you, bye.